the number one part of strategy is work with the chip manufacturer. And this is where a number of quarters, uh, within the four months, we announced that Qualcomm is using our hypervisor, okay? And they are already using our security way back when because of the cell phone. So that's, you know, and then we, and then yesterday, or the day before, sorry, the night before, NVIDIA announced that they're using our operating system for safety and um, security, right? And in their whole, the new, the whole new platform. I met with the NVIDIA CEO yesterday at a very good meeting, talking about the future and joint future. Um, NXP, which should, will be about Qualcomm, is a major customer of Alpha for a very long time. In fact, have bigger footprint in NXP than anybody else. In, in um, Intel, we have a relationship with Delphi. Delphi is building the new autonomous driven platform with Intel and uh, Mobileye, which Intel owns. We, had a, we announced that we have been picked as the basic operating system for the uh, Delphi platform. So if you, so, so you sit back and say, we have a relationship and actually be integrated in the chips. In NVIDIA, there's a chip of a set of eight that they're doing for autonomous driven vehicles. In, um, uh, in Intel, we have the, you know, the, the relationship with um, um, uh, Mobileye and, 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 uh, and Delphi as the platform, uh, Qualcomm hypervisors, NVIDIA hypervisors. So if you see the building up of the silicon, so to speak, okay, and that's important because I, don't, I, I wanted to make sure that we're into every car and, and the silicon is as basic as it gets. The, the best number one. Then the tier one. Um, the tier one, if you remember, uh, well, not too long ago, we announced our relationship with Denso. Denso, for those people who might, might not know, in Japan, they literally are the major number one provider of suppliers to Toyota, the motor company, including the Lexus line and the Camry, and, you know, and, and Toyota is the number one car manufacturer in the world. Um, so they are starting to use, because of the relationship, we're building a human-machine interface uh, protocol with them, which is when you get in the car, what does the car look like to you, or how they interact with you. This is the new, you know, new, new idea. New Again, it's based on about safety. And so, you know, so uh, we have Bosch, um, we have, we just discussed Denso, we have Delphi, uh, you know, we have relationship with all, almost all the tier one, and we have announcement with the latest and greatest one, which is Baidu. Baidu is going to make, you know, they're going to basically going to have uh, open source, a autonomous driving platform. Okay? And they picked us as the safety operating system. Uh, so the people who use the Baidu platform will automatically use this factory software. And so, again, you know, so we cover the tier one. It's very important. So we have the chip and the tier one, which is the number one supplier, 80% of the pro uh, components uh, of the auto world is supplied by the, you know, by the tier one to the OEM. Then we have the relationship directly with the OEMs. Um, for obviously, right, the, the biggest one was with Ford. Um, we had, which was just announced about a year ago, and uh, we have a very good uh, engineering to engineering relationship there. We're helping them to build new generation of cars. Um, and then uh, other ones that you could go to our booth and you would see. Um, who else we work with? Ashton Martin, Jaguar, uh, you know, a number of those uh, uh, car manufacturers around the world. We have about 40 OEMs, 40 direct OEMs working with us. So I, I think we build up quite an ecosystem. I think we have uh, protect ourselves in various layers. And then, of course, we're going to build on it. There's no question. I mean, this is not the end of it. This is, that's the beginning of it. And then we all, you know, also have branch out to not only building infotainment system, which we are famous <coughs> for, with Harman, uh, but we also branch out into other areas like advanced driver assist clusters, and virtual cockpit, and, and over the air technology, and hypervisors, and I think we have 12 different modules and applications. So this is why, you know, in the, it, as you come into the show, uh, a lot of emphasis is on IoT and a lot of emphasis on how do you make money on IoT? The way we make money on IoT is we tackle the security and safety of the automobile, the future automobile, the autonomous driving platform. 
Uh, but I also want to let you know the reason why I think you know, BlackBerry is a really great future because we could do the same thing in other verticals. We could do it in medical. We could do it in you know, energy and gas and oil. We could do it in government sectors. And we could do the same strategy by building up from the bottom up ground, building the channel distribution ecosystem and, and, and move up. And this is how, this is why the company is over. So, so I think as a really good future, given that.